Hello and welcome to this edition of Assignment Asia. I'm Barnaby Lowe. Japan is a country known for its spotlessness. It is also the world's second largest consumer of plastics. How much exactly? In terms of plastic bags, for instance, it's 30 billion a year. Like anywhere else in the world, there is growing awareness here of the issue. But one small town in particular is taking it a step further by going zero waste. It was early in the morning when we arrived at Takayoshi Kubo's home. First thing I see is trash all sorted and neatly lined up by the front door. Since 2016, Takayoshi has had to sort his trash into 45 categories. So when you got your information sheet from the town hall telling you how to sort your garbage, and it's like 45 different categories, what was your reaction? It's a far cry from decades ago, when everyone simply burnt or composted their waste in their own backyard. So 100% recycled, 100% used in your fields, your food waste. The composting hasn't changed, except he's gotten some help. So this is the machine that residents of Kamikatsu use to dispose of their organic waste. So it's really simple. They just put soil, put the organic waste, and this machine mixes the soil and the organic waste and then it produces fertilizer. That's it. Takayoshi has to do all these because his town is aiming for zero waste. えっと、ま、目標の中にやっぱり埋め立て焼却をゼロにする、ゼロに近づけていくということがあるんですけども、あの、現状ま、リサイクル率は80%で、やっぱり残りの20%というものはどうしてもこう焼却だったりとか埋
it was a taller order that needed all of Kamikatsu working together. In a town so rural, there's not a single supermarket. This resto bar stands out. But it isn't only because it's a western watering hole where no one else is. Rise and Wind Brewery is a living monument of Kamikatsu's zero waste mantra. と、クラフトビールで、ま、町の紹介もしているんですけれども、建物に廃材を使っています。で、町にとっては、あの、なんだろう。Step in, and it's impossible to miss the message. From the furnishing to second hand and eco friendly products for sale. And if you still don't get it, there are literally words all around the place that encourage a zero waste lifestyle. コンセプトがやっぱゼロウェイストなんですけど、やっぱ来てくれるお客さんがゼロウェイストを知らなくても楽しんでもらえるような工夫をしていて、私たちクラフトビールなのでビールの量り売りをしていて、例えばこれグラ
メタルとか、はい、そういうのを話して分けるんですよねスタッフが。Yeah. Oh, well, why is it why is it so important to have them all segregated like this? これはえっ、ー、とお金をこっちが払わないとリサイクルできない。で分けることによって、はい、そのコストを下げることができるんですね。Yeah. 一番ここの燃やすっていうゴミが一番お金かかるんです。何でも燃やしてたらものすごくお金がかかるけど、これ分けていってもらえると売れるものもあるし、処理費用が下がるものもある。だからお金をかけずにゴミを処理するっていう理由も一つあります。This, these ones go to the incinerator. Yes. Only these. Only these ones. Yes. And everything else gets recycled. Recycled. Wow. Recyclables are passed on or sold to third party recyclers. But stuff that can be reused or upcycled ends up here. Sorry, what is it? So, what does it say? Kuru Kuru Shop. Kuru Kuru Shop. Yes, and circulation. What does Kuru Kuru mean? Yeah. Circle. Circle. Yeah. Okay. And it's interesting.、Um, even the sign、mm. is、uh, of buttons. <laughs> Used <laughs> buttons. Yeah. Yes. これも理由です。Yeah. Okay. かわいい。Let's go in. Yeah. でこっちは子供服とか。Yeah. すぐうん子供すぐ大きくなるから。もうこういうなんかリユースできたらお母さんたちもすごく嬉しいですね。でここにあるものは全部無料で無料持って帰れます。Yeah. Not all items get picked up, of course. If they don't, they're eventually taken apart and recycled. Ultimately, though, what local authorities would like to see. It's less reusing and recycling, and more reducing. まあノーレジ袋だったりとか、あと量り売りだったりとかで、まあこのえっと容器包装類をまあ削減していくための取り組みをまあ去年ぐらいからスタートしているところです。Do you get a lot of people who come here and say we want to learn what you're doing here? ああそれは多いですよね。カメカツのゴミのやり方はが自分の町にあったらいいのにってみんな言います。It's flattering, but s n o is first to acknowledge that what works for a small town like Kamikatsu may not necessarily work for bigger, more populous cities. 技術も多分それぞれ国で違うけど、だからその手法、カミカツの手法を世界に広げたいってわけではない。その考え方。ゴミをなくさないとゴミと呼ばれてしまうものなくさないと本当に世界中困ってるでしょっていうところが伝わればいいかなと思います。In fact, Japan has a pretty serious waste problem. In Japan,、um, we have 9 million tons of plastic waste every year, That's, which is a lot. Just to be clear, though, Japan is not the world's biggest generator of plastic waste. But when you look at the amount each person contributes, it's the second highest globally. According to a 2018 United Nations report, only Americans generate more plastic waste per capita. Plastic の bag をくれないとですね、消費者にとっては店のサービスが悪いというふうにまでなってしまったということが大きな問題だなと思います。Okay, so just to show an example of just how obsessed the Japanese are. With plastic packaging, I just got out of a convenience store, and I bought a bottle of soda. And this, of course, ordinarily would come in a plastic bottle, but one piece of banana wrapped in plastic. And then this, you know, it's already got a plastic cover, but it's still covered 
in another layer of plastic. And of course, there's a plastic bag. All that plastic will have to wind up somewhere. The Japanese used to ship a significant chunk out, mostly to China. But in 2017, China said, no more. In 2017, The long-standing claim has been that the country recycles 80% of its plastic waste. But when I went to a waste treatment facility in Tokyo, I discovered this definition is rather broad. え、ここで処分しているのは、え、燃やすゴミと粗大ゴミ、大きいゴミですね。あと、不燃ゴミ。Waste is considered thermally recycled when its incineration produces energy. This facility and buildings nearby run on electricity produced by the incineration here. Now, remember that widely proclaimed 80% plastic recycling rate? It includes thermally recycled plastic waste. Environmentalists argue that it shouldn't. In a real situation, this, this isn't really should be calling to uh, recycling. It should be part of uh, an incineration, but, but different from simple incineration. And the incineration releases CO2, so it contributes to global uh, climate change. Tokyo's waste management officials are aware that thermal recycling isn't the best solution. They do want to go zero waste in the long run, but they're starting with baby steps. え、ま、プラスチック類の、え、ご家庭が出るプラスチック類のですね、消費ま、現在、え、東京都内で70万トンが消却に詰まってますけれども、その消却量をですね、40%削減しようというのが我々の2030までの目標です。Charging for the use of plastic bags, a policy that turned national mid 2020 is a start. But Yasuo believes more needs to be done. え、東京の企業と連携をして、え、製品を作る段階から、そもそもゴミが出ない製品を作るというところがゼロウェイストの一番の基本だと思います。Once again, Kamikatsu is ahead of the pack on this front. あの、今はま、役場とま、町とま、消費者、あの、住民という形で、ま、これまで頑張ってきて、ま、80% while it's up to authorities to enact green policies. Takayoshi Kubo says he'll continue doing his share, although it's getting more and more taxing for a man his age. Now, Maybe that's just the mindset we all need. That working towards zero waste isn't just about saving the environment, but humanity.
reduce, reuse, recycle. Three words we all have heard, but may not necessarily be applying to full extent in our daily lives. But it's possible, as Kamikatsu has shown. The question now is how to do it on a much larger scale. 